Want to know more about becoming a psychological well-being practitioner, PWP? What's a psychological well-being practitioner? Psychological well-being practitioners, or PWPs, deliver guided self-help to adults with anxiety and depression. These methods include written exercises, computerized packages, and mobile phone apps. PWPs have the rewarding role of helping people move forward in their life using structured and brief psychological interventions. We asked some PWPs to share their experience, and this is what they told us. What was your journey to train in your profession? I was a patient volunteer and then a support worker in the NHS. I completed a literature degree with Open University while I worked and I was accepted to PWP training. I finished my psychology degree with no idea what I wanted to do other than help people. My boyfriend's mum cut out a job ad in the local paper because it said psychological in the title. So I decided to give it a shot how does your work make a difference to people and the communities you serve? We make a big difference simply by offering accessible and psychological support for free. The part of my job is to make sure that the client and I can work to overcome barriers if there are any. What do you love about your role? Offering something that feels helpful to a lot of people without having to overanalyze. We help people to identify and build their own strength and skills and often we see positive change happen quickly. Although we only provide short-term support, it's amazing how much difference we can make to people's lives. It's about empowering people to help themselves. What are the best and worst things about your working day? The best things are talking with patients. Sometimes you're the first person they've shared with and it feels amazing to help relieve that burden. The worst thing is when we cannot help someone, knowing that someone needs help but our service isn't right and having to tell someone who is really struggling that they're going to have to wait or go for a different service. What does equality, diversity and inclusion mean to you? Recognising that everyone has got a unique experience of life and a unique sense of self that we can approach with humility and curiosity, that we can acknowledge and value. What advice would you give to someone considering training in your profession? The training year is challenging as well as rewarding. So having a good sense of the role and whether it fits with your career aims and values is important. If you could have a time machine and start again, what would you want to know about your career path? Looking after yourself is the only way to sustainably help other people. Want to know more about how to become a PWP? Go to ppn.nhs dot uk slash resources slash careers dash map